Hi there. Yogi, Virendra Yogi, beloved friends. Here I have just shown you one page from a wonderful book which made millions, millionaire and successful person on this globe. Written by my guru and guide, Dr. Napoleon Hill, who was student of Andrew Carnegie. He wrote several books, The Law of Success, which was compiled in a very beautiful way in 1937, and that was named Think and Grow Rich. Here he is telling that we should have six fundamentals to become successful in life. Desire, decision, faith, persistence, mastermind alliance partner, and a practical plan of action. But beloved friends, everything you have, you know exactly where you want to go before you start, that is your definition of purpose. You are also smart enough to decide promptly and definitely with determination, commitment and devotion to attain whatever you want because you believe in the philosophy of win or perish, victory or death, do or die. You are willing, desiring, determined with full determination to get it. That's fine. Also, you are persevering, persisting, continually moving towards the progressive realization of your dreams and desires. You are wise enough to have the best brains whom you have motivated and inspired to cooperate with you, to guide you and give you the full support with their wealth, with their wisdom, with their ideas. They have also a very practical plan of action, very practical plan, effective and magnificent plan so that you will attain your goal. But one thing what Napoleon Hill is emphasizing here, believing. <laughs> Confucius said, you can do it and you can never do it. Both ways you are correct because it depends on you how much you believe in yourself. That's why the poem I want to recite before you, which you have already read at the beginning of my talk. If you think you are beaten, you are. If you think you are beaten, you are. If you think you dare not, you don't. If you like to win and you think you can't, it's almost certain that you won't. How beautiful it is. It's you who have to decide what you are. If you think you will lose, you are lost. For out in the world we find, success begins with person's will. It is in the state of mind. Yes. A strong mind, a determined mind, a committed mind, a believing mind, will really create a genuine, creative, magical circumstances where he is bound to be successful. Because you know all the greats believed and they become. They visualize and they practicalize it because their vision, their mission, their purpose all become reality. That is the real philosophy here. So if you think you are lost, you are lost. If you think you will lose, you are lost. For out in the world we find, success begins with the person's will. It is in the state of mind. The human will that forces on sin, the offspring of a deathless soul, can hew away to any goal. The walls of grand interfere. Be not impatient in delay, but wait. As one who understands, when this spirit rises and commands, gods are ready to obey, beloved friends. And what he says, if you think you are outclassed, you are. 
you have got to think high to rise yes you have to think that you can rise you can reach the climax if you think you are out class you are you have got to think high to rise you have to be sure of yourself even you can win a prize and lastly what napoleon hill share with us the life's battle don't always go to the strong or the fast man but sooner late the when he wins is the man who thinks he can she can i can we can you can remember it you can do it because you are blessed with the power of the mind whatever the mind can conceive and believe the mind can achieve for us but the only limitation we impose in our thinking big dreaming big believing not sufficiently lacking self discipline self reliance self confidence and if you really think you can do it you can do it go ahead everything is waiting for you all your dreams are waiting all your desires are going to be fulfilled have faith in yourself in god follow the real path integrity honesty sincerity persevering persisting striving seeking finding different ways and means to reach your goal to reach your purpose of life thank you very much may god bless you